So welcome back. In this video, um, I'm just going to walk you through uh, something that I've been looking at and um, you might find it interesting with regards to the Microsoft Rewards uh, Edge extension uh, for the Edge browser, obviously. Um, so it's, a, and um, I'll show you how to install it, a few things you need to know about it and um, just a few quick tips, but I, I certainly recommend um, using it. So here I have my Edge browser open. You can see in the top right hand corner here, I have the rewards extension installed. View of um, my point status, my activities and my daily sets, what I've done. You can see here today, I've done everything out of 90, 90 out of 90 for a PC search, 12 out of 12 for a search on Edge and 60 out of 60 searches uh, on my uh, browser on my mobile device. Um, and you can minimize this and you can see that I've done all my completed offers and uh, things like that. So it's a really handy little tool to have installed and uh, running within your browser. But how do you do this? And what are some things you need to know? So firstly, um, if I just close that Edge add-ons for Edge add-ons um, add right here. Um, so what you can do is uh, I'll, I'll put this link in the description but um, if you go to the Edge add-ons uh, page, uh, which is this one here, which is where it loads, and you just type in here, boards, like that, um, you can see the Edge, the add-ons for Edge that you have. So in here, I've got Microsoft Rewards uh, installed because it says remove, and all these other ones that are down here um, says get because I don't actually have those ones. So the one we want to look at is the Microsoft Rewards one, um, and it says remove again. It's it's because it's installed, and you can see that I'm running it. That's it installed in my browser um, right there. So if I click on the actual rewards itself, um, so this is where it gets interesting, and I um, want to point out to you. So um, it's the Microsoft Rewards um, Edge add-on. Over a million users have um, have installed it to their browser. Um, but it says over here, on ver it's version 1.0 of the um, of the actual um, extension. But I can either remove it or turn it on. So I'm looking at that thinking, well, you know, it's installed, but therefore it's not on. So I, I have the option to turn it on. And it says underneath installed but disabled. So let's have a look at that a little bit more uh, closer. If I go turn on, um, it comes up with these little pop-ups and saying, uh, to help protect your browser settings, Edge has turned off the rewards extension. And this is what you need to know if you're going to be using uh, the rewards extension uh, plugin for your browser. So it comes up here and says, how do I turn on this extension? You have a look at it and it takes you to a uh, support page. Why does Microsoft Edge turn off extensions that I've installed? Now it's more around privacy settings and, uh, and things like that. So if I go back here again, I can turn it on and it basically takes me back to this page here. But if I click, and you can see up here, one thing I want to show you is that, see how it's like, um, it's it's installed, but there's no color to the icon. That means it's installed, but not turned on. So if I go in here, uh, in settings, the little hamburger icon here, and go extensions, and then brings up the customization extension, and I click manage extensions. This is where I can turn it on. Now, this is what I want to point out to you here. Um, if we go into details, if I turn this on, it's only a, a very small extension, it's only about a meg. If I turn this on, I therefore give permissions from my browser to read my browsing history, display notifications, change, it changes my search settings to bing.com. So if you're using another browser, it'll change that to bing.com. And it'll also manage my apps extensions and themes. So if I just toggle this switch here to on, you see how this one here now comes up and it's blue, which means it's on and enabled. If I click on it, it's exactly the same here as the one that's disabled, but working. And it, it tells me the same details in the page, but I turn it off and it goes away. If I turn it on, I get, I get this and I get the extensions tab come up here saying Microsoft Rewards is obviously installed and running. I can hide it from the toolbar or I can manage the extension, remove it from Edge or go straight to Microsoft Rewards. So 
Um, that's one thing. This is a quick little video. Uh, again, if you're getting into Microsoft Rewards, it's really helpful to know um, that if you do enable this or, or turn it on, um, you therefore give um, permissions from your browser for Microsoft Rewards to read your browsing history, display notifications, basically more interaction uh, with um, more interaction with the browser <clears throat> and things like that. So I'm not sure whether that's suitable for you. You can uh, toggle the in private uh, settings here as well. But it says here your browser history may still be recorded even though you have um, in private enabled. Um, so just a few things to to get to know there. I, I actually run it like this. I just leave it off and just use it like that. So the um, the page here says remove or turn on. So I know that it's it's installed because I can remove it. Can't remove something that's not installed. Um, and it's installed but disabled. So those those are the things that I like to run in my browser when because I run rewards pretty much every day to get my points. Um, it's one thing that I, I like to do uh, there as well. Again, turn on and it tells you how to do this. It's back in here. It's back under extensions, manage extension. And um, you, you can do those, uh, you can do those things in here. And there it is there, comes up and running. So you don't necessarily need it running and turned on. You can run the extension, but have it disabled. Uh, again, these are the details that you need to know. So um, hope you hope you're getting some uh, some some good uh, some good um, having some fun with the rewards. And if you're thinking of turning on the extension, it's a good extension to have. Um, this is something that you might need, to, and um, it's it, it's a pretty simple thing to 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 manage. Um, but that's just a quick video on the overview of what happens when you install this particular uh, Edge extension and how to manage it within your browser.